pedestrian bridge that connects downtown Dallas with West Dallas may be named after a former mayor now. And Fox 4's Dan Godwin is live with the latest. And Tim, there is talk around Dallas City Hall of renaming the Continental Avenue Bridge after former Dallas Mayor Ron Kirk. This pedestrian bridge spans more than 2,100 feet across the Trinity River. It runs alongside the Margaret Hunt Hill Bridge, which accommodates vehicle traffic. Now, today, the city's Transportation and Trinity River Project Committee will be briefed on renaming the bridge in honor of the former mayor. The 85 year old bridge underwent a significant upgrade. A couple of years ago, with the addition of a pedestrian plaza and park. But the renaming idea is not without some controversy. Kirk serves on an advisory committee that, according to the Dallas Morning News, supports building a tollway along the eastern levee of the Trinity River. And that road proposal could require removing close to 200 feet of the west end of the historic Continental Avenue Bridge. And the morning news says some city council members believe because of that, it doesn't make sense to name the bridge after Ron Kirk. Kirk became Dallas's first black mayor in 1995. He served until 2002. Also, during President Obama's first term in office, Kirk served as U.S. Trade Representative, which is a cabinet level position. These days, Kirk is an attorney and he is helping the private company that's trying to build a high speed rail line between Dallas and Houston. Now, the final decision on renaming the Continental Avenue Bridge rests with the Dallas City Council. Council Council members expected to make a vote on the issue next month. Reporting live, Dan Godwin on Good Day.